Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do your February 2018 general reading. Um, thank you for tuning in. Please like, share, comment. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you're feeling moved. Uh, I'll save the announcements to the end, okay? So we're going to do a Celtic cross spread for Leo. Leo love. What can you tell us about Leo and love? Thank you, thank you, thank you, Heavenly Angels, for true, accurate messages for Leo and love. Messages for Leo and love. Leo's in love. Come on. Come on. Leo's in love. All right, Leo, lots of, lots of queens here. No kings, all queens. All right, so in the foundation, we have the two of swords. Someone needs to make a decision. There's a bit of opposition here, a, a bit of unknown. You need to make a decision. You need to be like the queen of spades. She cuts what no longer serves her, what isn't good for her out she cuts liars half truths all that stuff out if it doesn't make sense she it's out um you this could be the energy that you need to take on or this could be you needing to cut an actual uh gemini libra aquarius out of your your life or your circle you need to take a rest from them or you need to make a decision in some in some manner. In the recent past was an offer, the Jack of Diamond. But this is a dishonest, disloyal, untrustworthy person. Could be in the past, could be a Capricorn Virgo Taurus. Doesn't have to be, but you know, that's the nature of this card in the playing cards deck. Um, the reason why all of this is happening is because I think someone has tapped into their intuition. They're really working with spirit. They're getting downloads from spirit as to what's going on around them with the queen of hearts. And or you could be dealing with the cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They could be the catalyst for all of this. Or it just could be your intuition. You're being a little bit more intuitive. Uh, presently, you have the six of diamond this is problems in second relationship or second marriage but then right on top of that we have a five of diamond and this is success in home and in marriage so i think there are problems in in home but a lot of you want success there and you want things to be uh, reconciled going forward it looks like there's you in the near future the queen of clubs very confident, very charismatic, very regal, very outgoing, very, um, you know, you could be an entrepreneur. You know a lot of people. You're the mover and the shaker. You you get the party started. And your energy is the jack of hearts. You could be offering uh, love or someone's offering love to you. Love could be on the table here. But what's external to you is the five of hearts. This is hesitating before making decisions this is grief this is grieving this you know could be grieving a situation before you even made the decision or someone else is and the hopes and fears is the ten of diamond um, good fortune good money 
your luck is changing partnership home life is good money is good this is definitely a hope here the outcome is the eight of cups you could be having or the eight of hearts you could be having visitors in your home you could be attending a wedding if not you could be emotionally checking out of a situation while having a new passionate creative start in health wealth and happiness uh, by way of walking away from what no longer serves you emotionally let's pull a few more cards who is the queen of hearts okay so we got the nine of club this is the new boyfriend new girlfriend maybe this is um just that a new boyfriend new girlfriend cancer pisces scorpio for leo who is the jack of diamond in the recent past the king of diamonds so definitely an earth sign here who wasn't coming up in the highest vibration um dishonest disloyal unreliable untrustworthy was the queen of club was the queen of club what's the queen of club all right the four of diamond um this is this talks about a windfall a large sum of money you could be winning the lottery What is the two of spade and the queen of spade? The two of spade and the queen of spade. Three of hearts. You, so you want to practice caution in saying things because you may say things that you regret. There might be some surprise news here. It's good news. It could be baby news. You could be waiting for this news. Or, right, waiting for the good news of an ending. Or maybe things trans, transforming or, or definitely an ending. What is the Jack of Hearts? The Ace of Hearts. Nice. New love. The offer of love. And you've got the new boyfriend, new girlfriend on the Queen of hearts nice that's really good what's the five of hearts hesitating before making decisions grieving what's the five of hearts what's the five of hearts ten of hearts queen of diamonds seven of spades yeah you have to make a decision about this this home life this family life Maybe with the Capricorn Virgo Taurus, they were coming up as sneaky, a liar, a cheat. You need this is loss of friendship and loss of burden to carry. Also, so maybe you had to make a decision about, or you're grieving the the, yeah, you're, you're grieving the fact that you did have to make the decision to uh, walk away from what was already established. The Ten of Diamond. What's the Ten of Diamond? Three of Sword. So, yes, yeah, some of you are going to. Um, this is home life in partnership. Some of you are going to be partaking in divorce, separation. You need to partake in caution in relationship. Practice some caution in your relationship due to infidelity or dishonesty. It looks like for some of you, or it could be for a collective. Oh, nice. Once you emotionally check out of something, you have a new passionate start in health, wealth, and happiness. And then the 10 of clubs in the playing card deck talks about good luck, unexpected money. So that's really good. We also have the windfall card here sitting on top of you, the four of diamond. So you've got good money coming in and a uh, new start in love 
could be with a water sign. It all looks good, Leo. Um, let's get you a butterfly oracle card for your focus for the month. Looks like you're staying away from an earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, self-employment. Nice. That's what you need to be working on, self-employment. Pour your money that you receive back into you, back into business. Self-employment is here for you. Gracefully aging, new career, retirement. Wow. All three of these, and sometimes retirement talks about self-employment, a change in how you make your money, a change in hours. If not a complete retirement, you might drop down to part-time uh, due to your new career, which could be all due to you and how you self-employ yourself. Uh, do take note of how you're aging or... Um, if you can help the process, help the process. Uh, a new beauty regimen. Um, getting tips offline. Um, so many different things. Gracefully aging. Also, dressing your age, I'm hearing. Being age appropriate. For some of you. Anyway, Leo, it looks good. Money looks good. Love looks good. It's good. It's a really good reading. A lot of you are moving away from what no longer serves you, moving into new love, money, self-employment, a new career, retirement for some of you, outright retirement, or just a shift in how you, how many hours you put into making your money, okay? So, Leo, if this resonated with you, please click that subscribe button, like the, the channel, excuse me, like the video. Um, request a personal reading to expound on the energy uh, follow me on Instagram my handles are below follow me on Instago it's a new app where you can reach me via text message I can pull a few cards for you in regards to one situation one question um, request a personal reading by emailing me tarotofl at gmail.com take advantage of the $25 25 minute readings those will end they I think the price will go up because I never stick to 25 minutes. So, anyhow, moving right along. Thank you, Leo, for tuning in. It looks like a really good month for February. Take care. Happy Valentine's Day. Um, talk to you soon.